prospects for privacy and uh, pseudonymity better now, uh, better or worse now, uh, in your opinion? I'm of the uh, strong opinion that that is completely up to us and not uh, up to our environment. And in a way, the political and environmental changes of the last two years have led to a lot of people taking their lives, their privacy and everything more serious. So um, that is good for them because they have a chance of breaking out of the golden cage now. Yeah, I think we see more and more merchants uh, actually demanding to be paid in Bitcoin. Um, and you know, with with those private jets, that's that's certainly a, a, a fun thing. Like I think fifty Bitcoin, and you get yourself a Learjet thirty five A. You know, and that's a nice cross Atlantic uh, smooth drive, uh, even. Um, uh, so yeah, why why not? I th I think we definitely need uh, a, a a mesh network of multiple citadels uh, and secure travel, secure and private travel among them, uh, and uh, self owned and operated flights. Uh, or to this day, uh, uh, enjoy the highest privacy benefit where, where the least amount of information needs to be leaked uh, to public officials. Um, so it's it's definitely a, a worthwhile thing to consider. Of course, well, expensive, you know. Um, so uh, it's a question if, if you want to spend your Bitcoin on that. So um, just adding with, to what uh, Penguin said um, and to what everybody here has been talking about this whole time, you know, uh, these guys are, are more tech savvy than I, and they're, they're talking about what I would call like high technology and and digital technology, right? Um, what? But technology is a lot of things. It's methods, it's machinery, it's ideas, it's plans, it's it's the um, skills. It's it's all of these things, and the the core at the core of community technology and also uh, neighborhood power is to uh, reimagine our relationship with production and to also reimagine our relationship with technology. So tech, um, technology serves us rather than serving uh, the state and institutions. So currently the uh, technology develops to serve uh, central, uh, centralized institutions and the state. But if we can take this back and repurpose technology to serve uh, ourselves and um, and te with technology take back production to serve ourselves and to be able to produce things um, on a peer-to-peer -peer and individual and community level that this would create the material base uh, to to build a, a free society um, is, is the way that Carl Hess would put that. Um, so this it includes things like digital technology, cryptocurrency, uh, uh, cryptography, um, communications. But this also, um, going to the homesteading thing, this also means food production and uh, how we, you know, create energy for ourselves and uh, how we we uh, make water potable to drink. You know, all of these things, all of um, the aspects of our lives that are involved with uh, producing goods and services.